Today we're going to be talking about what's going on with Crypto.com and the CRO token. What in the world is this a buy? I can only speak for me personally, but I'm going to give you my thoughts on this project, on this platform. For those of you who've been following me for a while, you know that I've made many videos about Crypto.com. I still love Crypto.com. I still think the cards are incredible. I think it's kind of foolish for almost anyone not to have the Crypto.com cards. They give you $25 in free CRO token, their native token. Now would be the time to earn those free tokens because it's so cheap. We'll talk about that in a moment. We'll talk about what's going on and my thoughts on it. Um, if you want to check get, check out the Crypto.com card, debit card, download. You can download the app and get that debit card. I'll put a link down in the description. If you use my code, you will get $25 in free CRO tokens once you update upgrade to their Ruby card. And we'll talk about that a little bit more in this video. Okay, if you love Crypto.com as much as I do, or if you want to know more about Crypto.com and you want to follow this project, make certain that you subscribe to my channel, hit the bell notification icon, and when you get the chance, select all. Select all. For whatever reason, I was just told by one of my subscribers yesterday they wanted to follow me, but they haven't seen one of my videos in almost a year. When they saw my videos, I was down to about 2,000 subscribers. Now I'm up to 12,000 subscribers, and they had not gotten notified of my videos. You have to not just subscribe. You have to click the bell notification, and you have to select all. All right, let's start talking. So first of all, let's look at the price. Right now, Crypto.com is down. The CRO token is down by, I mean, at one point it was up here at 18 cents. That was incredible. And it's and many of us were buying it over here at like 10, 12 cents, and we thought we were doing good there. And we were glad to see it to go to 18. But now it's dropped, and it's dropped all the way down, you know, like 70% or so. All the way down here to 6 cents, 6.6 .6 cents. So what in the world's going on? What caused this to happen? Well, first and foremost, the single biggest thing that happened is over the past month, Crypto.com lowered the interest rate that they were paying on their stake tokens by, depending on the token, it got lowered by you know around 2%. So instead of 6%, you were getting 4%, etc. A lot of people hated that. There was a lot of whales that had a lot staked on there. And people really saw that as a turning point. Now, I, if you've been following my channel for a while, I have made no bones about it that I thought at some point they were going to have to stop paying out so much. I mean, on their token, the CR token, at one point, I think they were paying out, I think it was 16%. Th that's an enormous amount. They can't continue paying that. I think they dropped that all the way down to, I don't even know, I'm earning it, I don't even know. I think it's 10%, 6%, maybe. They've dropped it down a lot, and that may have had a lot to do with this price crash. For me, that was actually a positive sign long term. Because I knew that they were going to have to make that change as they matured as a company. That was I said it a long time ago. They were going to have to make that change. But I think for a lot of people, they, it just, you know, blood in the streets, it just started dumping. And when it got here, as you can see, emotionally, the charts oftentimes indicate emotion. I'm not a big technical guy. I think the charts, some people say the charts reflect fundamentals. I think, if anything, especially in the short term, charts primarily show emotion. Because if you look at this, see how far it's dropped all the way down here to six cents. I just told my own brother today, he was asking about crypto. I just told him, if you're going to get into crypto, I would get a crypto.com card and I would at the very least upgrade to the Ruby or the Jade Green card if you have the disposable income because the, the token is, is so cheap. And here's why I said that. The fundamentals don't line up with this price. Keep in mind, they lowered for the longevity of their company. They could not continue to pay out as much as they were paying out in profits. If you hold a token, you want a company to do well. You want the project to do well. You want the company to be profitable. So if they do anything to increase profits, that is technically good long term. That's the fundamental that shifted. Let, but that's not all. Let's look at the news that got put out this month. So 1st of December, so I guess it went out today. These are the updates from 2020. Okay, these are the updates so far from November 2020. Let's just scroll down. The The Visa card is coming to Canada. So th those of you that are Canadian, go down in the description, get your, uh, download the app, get your Visa card. That's a positive. That's huge. Open up an entire market. What, 30 million people in Canada now can potentially get the Crypto.com debit card? Margin trading launched in private beta on exchange. So Crypto.com, a, a legal, you don't have to worry about like BitMEX is kind of skirting around the laws, a, a very the regulatory compliant company is bringing margin trading. Now, this isn't probably not going to be available to U.S. citizens, but you know we're just a small part of their entire total 
you know, customer base or client base. So they're going to be bringing out margin trading. It's already in, in beta. That's excellent news for the project long term. DeFi swap now integrated with Crypto.com DeFi wallet. That's incredible. Great news. DeFi is the rage right now. Crypto.com joined the Visa tra Fast Track program, supporting the next generation of fintechs. The number of fintechs part of the Visa's Fast Track program has increased by 360% year over year. We're excited to announce that we joined Visa's Fast Track program to further accelerate the development and distribution of innovative payment solutions. Read more about it here. Again, positive fundamental news. Crypto.com is the first cryptocurrency company to achieve the highest maturity levels under the NIST cybersecurity and privacy framework. Crypto.com has been rated adaptive tier four, the highest maturity level under the National Institute of Standard and Technology, cybersecurity framework, and NIST privacy framework, which was developed by the U.S. Department of Commerce. The milestone means Crypto.com is now the first cryptocurrency company in the world to meet ISO 27001, whatever that is, PCI standards compliance understand that and achieve the highest maturity levels of the respective nist frameworks again security all this sounds good this is good for a financial company crypto.com joins the international digital asset association okay great btc now on supercharger again not available for us but those of you that are in the supercharger it's essentially farming a, it's essentially a way to stake your cro tokens to farm bitcoin those of you that are familiar with farming governance tokens Imagine being able to farm Bitcoin. De uh, wow. $250,000 allocation. Users can deposit CRO into the supercharger pool to earn BTC rewards from now until 29th of December. That's already... Oh, it's still going. Okay. It's still going. Again, not available for U.S. customers, but the rest of the world, that's positive news. This isn't a no-name token. It's freaking Bitcoin. Again, are you seeing this? All this is positive fundamentals. Positive fundamentals. It looks good for the longevity of the company. Crypto.com app updates. New listing on the app. RLC, whatever that is. We listed IEC RLC in the Crypto.com app. I'm not familiar with it. In addition to a growing list of 80 plus cryptocurrencies and stable coins. Awesome. Deposits. Now you can get uh, deposits and, and uh, withdrawals with Polkadot. Uniswap and Polkadot are now available. That's awesome. Earn up to 5% on Unidot, uh, Uniswap and Polkadot. Where else can you make 5% on your earnings per annum? Users can now earn up to 3% per annum on their crypt, in the crypto, der, uh, crypto earn. Paid in Uni and DOT. New DeFi tokens added to recurrent buying. All these are positive. Positive developments. Canadian bank transfers and USD wire transfers now available. Transfers now available. Positive. Positive. But guys, look how long this is. We're still going down the list. New language is added. D5 updates. Introducing a new dashboard. Okay, awesome. Multi-wallet theorem test net support. Okay, great. New new tokens on D5. I'm just going through this quickly. D5 integrated. D5 swap integrated into one inch pathfinder and paraswap. Awesome news. Crypto.com exchange updates. New listings on the exchange. Polkadot, Ren, Ontology. Good stuff. New trading pair. BTC to USDC. Crypto.com pay updates. Wallet Connect and MetaMask. Now integrated in Crypto.com pay. This is extraordinary. Crypto.com pay now integrated with coin tracking info. Good stuff if you're trying to track your 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 accounts. Crypto.com card updates. European card program mitigation completed. Good stuff. This is the entire European market. Community updates. So do, do you see like live video AMA? Okay. AMA with Ledger. Digital currencies. Live AMA. They're out there in the news. They're doing their thing. A rewards best crypto wallet of course it is stratus token swap okay so all of this is is positive fundamentals what changed to cause the price to drop only one thing only one thing they cut rates which they had to cut for the longevity of the company and they only cut it by a couple percentage points that was the well crypto, the cro token actually got cut by a bit more however what mattered what the fundamentals that matter most for the longevity of the company without question is in my opinion all these updates now let me just say i'm i'm i always like to present both sides for me personally bitcoin having gone way up hitting all-time highs yesterday or whatever may, may hit all-time highs again today but bitcoin going way up me earning passive income in bitcoin the the for me Crypto.com, right now, I like to diversify way. If, if I'm going to take profits, what I'm typically going to do is take one crypto that's gone up a lot 
sell a portion of that for another crypto. And for me, I can't tell you what to do. For me, CRO would be one of those that I would consider doing. Um, in fact, if I had not already updated to the J Green card, I would definitely be doing it. By the way, I got another video coming out. I just purchased a, a computer yesterday using my crypto.com debit card. I'm going to show that in another upcoming video. So be sure to hit the subscribe button. So for me personally, and, and by the way, that's another thing. At 6.6 .6 cents, where are we at? Yeah, still at 6.6 .6 cents. I mean, take a look at this. Where are we at? Right here. So 2,500 tokens to get the root card. Uh, the Well, actually, let me just take you here real quick so you can see. If you don't know anything about the MCO Visa card, let me just play this real quick. Bitcoin, the best money we have ever had. With a different kind of money comes a different kind of card. A metal card powered by crypto. Every time you spend, you get 3% back instantly. Want more? We've got that too. Paired with a powerful and secure app that lets you manage your digital assets in one place. Have an issue? Connect with a real person 24-7. Don't like fees? Neither do we. Oh, one more thing. How about these perks? The future is here. Reserve yours now. So that's the crypto.com debit card. I currently have the J green card here, but when you get this card for free, you get 1% cash back. If you get the CRO token, you get two, I mean the, the Ruby card, you get 2% cash back. And this is the one where they give you $25 in free CRO tokens. $25, if you're going to get your $25 tokens, you'd rather get them at six cents than get them at 18 cents. So just to show you right now what that cost would be times 0 0.066. So it's $165. By the way, you're not paying that. You're just getting $165 worth of those tokens and you're staking them on the platform. You will always have 2,500 tokens that you can unstake at some point in the future should you choose to. If you want the 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 J green card right now, that's going to be $1,650. If this CR tokens go back up to $0.10, cents, which I believe they easily could in my personal opinion, again, not financial advice, but that would be $1,650. And of course, then you're going to get 3% cash back. You're going to get your 100% Spotify covered, your Netflix, and you get your airport lounges. And complimentary as well. So, if you're going to get the, if you're going to, if you're gonna, same thing, if you're going to come over here, that's 16000 right now at the current price. So, if you're going to upgrade, and over here, that's 160000 That's crazy. Uh, that's my goal. You got to have goals in life. But, that's 8% cash back, by the way. That's killer. Here's the thing. Ladies and gentlemen, if you are going to upgrade now would be the time to upgrade. If you were going to take some profits, this is one to consider. Do your own research, but it's definitely one to consider. No question. Now, let me tell you what I don't like about crypto.com and I'll end it with this. I am pro decentralization. I am pro companies moving towards more decentralization. And a lot of these updates are really more about crypto.com getting in bed with the traditional financial system. I like that in the short term and i like it from a company standpoint it's kind of like it's kind of like if i cared about the environment and i don't i don't really like the fact that big oil companies and traditional investing you know hurt the environment and i don't like that however from an investing standpoint i recognize people need cars and people need to travel and people need gas so i recognize that it is a good investment um, and it's, the company's not going anywhere the gas companies particular oil company or gas company's not going anywhere but, you know, I, I don't love what it's doing for the environment. So you got to make that question for yourself. For me personally, long term, originally Crypto.com was talking about taking the CRO token and decentralizing finance, yada, yada, yada. And I love that. But now what you're seeing at this point is they're moving more towards centralized finance. Now, you know, my, my fantasy goal here is that they're moving towards centralized finance right now to be a part of the system. But behind the scenes, I would like to think that they're creating technology that allows them to go decentralized should the market ever demand that that's just that may just be a pure fantasy but at this point i recognize that the market by and large the crypto market wants centralization which is unfortunate um however for someone getting started in crypto it is crypto.com is by far the easiest fastest way to buy bitcoin using a bank account i have a video on that i'll link it above it's the fastest easiest way to buy bitcoin using a bank account and not only that but it's also uh, the most compliant if you want to make certain that you don't have to worry about 
KYC, AML regulations, be able to pay your taxes on your crypto. You know, they provide all the paperwork for that. They're very, very compliant, regardless of what government that you are, that you reside in. So for someone brand new getting into crypto, this is far better than a lot of options because even with Coinbase, you buy crypto, you can't take it off of Coinbase for days. You buy crypto on crypto.com, you can take it off the moment it hits your account, which if you do it with a bank account, you're going to have crypto, you're going to have fiat in your account. If you download the app, you're going to have fiat on the app, cash on the app that you can use immediately to buy cryptocurrency. And you can immediately withdraw it off the app if you should you choose to. So for people getting started in crypto, I always recommend a crypto.com card 100%. And I believe the CRO token, in my personal opinion, at these levels is a buy. Could it go lower? Of course it could. It could go all the way down to three cents and two cents. So that just means that it's a very strong buy for me. Because I believe the to the future of this project, the future of this company, is extremely bright. Hey, let me know your thoughts down with on Crypto.com down in the comments. Thank you so much for watching. If you love Crypto.com, be sure to hit the subscribe button, smash that like button, ladies and gentlemen. Of course, hit the bell notification icon. And stay tuned. I'm going to be doing a video where I show you uh, that I actually bought my laptop using my card. If you want to see that. Also, I just had an investment that did incredibly, incredibly, incredibly well. Like I five or six x it within you know a few moments and i'm going to be maybe like less than an hour i'll be talking about that in an upcoming video as well you don't want to miss it on the end screen you can watch the video where i show you how to buy bitcoin or how to buy yeah how to buy bitcoin with your bank account using the crypto.com app i'll put that tutorial on the end of this video hey thank you so much for watching decentralized crypto equals freedom this is crypto wealth i'm out